Hi and welcome back to Waves. News making waves in the maritime sector are coming in from Korea. Researchers at the Korean Advanced Institute of Science and Technology said that success is not far off the design of a mobile harbor. Researchers have conceptualized the mobile harbor as a lean, lightweight system for unloading container ships along any coastline. The institute's president, Su Nam Pyo, said that the, he got the idea of a mobile harbor while visiting Singapore. Why do the ships come to the harbor, he questioned. Why not have the harbor go out there and bring the goods in? After mobilizing to the U.S. Gulf of Mexico to complete deep water sea trials and final outfitting, ENSCO 8502 will commence a two-year drilling contract with the subsidiary of Nexon. The contract may be extended to a three- or a four-year term at Nexon's request. Drilling operations are scheduled to commence late in second quarter of 2010. Some news from China. The chairman of China CSSC Holdings, China's largest shipbuilding group, has recently visited the site of a new shipyard under construction in Zhuai, Guangdong. The base has a coastline of 9,000 meters and covers an area of 107 million square meters. This world-class shipbuilding base will specialize in offshore and high-tech ships. The offshore sector is projected to continue growing while the traditional shipbuilding sector is seen to continue on its decline. In early 2009, the Chinese government identified the offshore and high-tech vessels sector as an important and encouraged its growth. CSSC said that it believed in the development of the ocean engineering equipment to upgrade China's shipbuilding industry. That is all the news making ways as of now. Stay tuned for more news later on. See you then.